Madagascar is a very, very, very beautiful island. But we forgot that this country is one of the poorest in the world. There's no issue about the lack of resources of water. The water is there, but it's not used properly. The access to water services is very low. Less than one person out of two have access to water in Madagascar. OVIC is a very uh, important partner for UNICEF. Uh, we've been together in a partnership for about 15 years now, so it's a very uh, uh, long-lasting and, and fruitful partnership, I would say, which enables us to uh, put together some, some nice projects on the field. We've been to different health centers and what struck me there was the fact that you have hundreds of mothers uh, who are coming with their babies and they are really willing to provide them a better future. And which means for them that they want them to have access to safe drinking water, they want to make sure the baby are growing healthy. might not be very obvious, but there, are, there is a strong link between access to water and, and also access to school. One, because children, when they take a lot of time to go to get some water, which is a need for the family, obviously, then they don't go to school. There is also another link, uh, which is the availability of, of water within the school. When a school doesn't have water or latrines, sometimes the parents are more reluctant to send their, their, their kids to school, especially the girls. Here, when we want to have access to water, it's super simple. You just need one second, you turn the tap, and then you have access to water. When you go there, you realize how difficult it is in your daily life without safe water access. We've been to several schools and what struck me uh, was that you really realize that behind numbers, you have actually real people and that you're impacting really the people in there and their daily life. We meet uh, Clara and Jacquino, uh, brothers and sisters. We meet also their family. And we realize that thanks to the help of UNICEF, Clara can go to school. She doesn't have to spend hours walking for fetching water. If you want children to grow healthy and unleash their potential for a better future, they need safe water access. This is crucial for them.